Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Ghost Dude, and this is part two of the Abominus. And now we're going to combine the five figures into two Abominus. We're going to start with the feet first. So let's get them out here. Um, Cyndasaurus or Ripper Sniper Patrol, when you have the, the same mode, so they work fine. Um, I'm going to bring this piece up. That's going to form a kneecap. Down here. Um, da -da 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 -da. Don't know you need that. I don't know. Actually, hold on a second. Let's see that. And you need the head together, I believe. Or not. Ah. Ah, okay. So. Yeah, still trying to figure out how to transform Ripper Snapper. I did it once, now I don't remember how the hell to do it. Oh boy. Okay, let's see. Da -da -da. Do you leave them open? No, I think you leave them closed together. Because they'll form foot. Oh, actually, no, I remember. You do need to open them, then you turn this down so it have a flat surface. That's right. And then you put them together. And I guess need the feet, uh, his hands out as the toes. So it will look something like this. Uh, these are not that high up actually. I was just trying to figure out where to put them. I think something like this. I don't know. That seems about right. I believe. If I can just get a bit, just a bit. Alright. Thank you. <clears throat> so that's one leg. Now we're going to uh, Bright. Wanna turn his head like this? Don't open all the way. Then you want to take uh, da -da 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 -da, his arms and turn them around, and actually open up his chest so he can move his arms closer. It's gonna be like this, and there are two pegs on either side. And there's a hole on each arm, and that's gonna plug in like that. And they don't really stay stay in. They just Hold it down. I mean, it's very loose. Mine. Yeah. So, open that up. That's going to form a leg. It's going to be pointing like this. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, flip these down. Like so. And then fold them up. And there's also pegs out here. And it's going to peg into the arm. I do one arm at a time to see where it's at. And you can do the rest. If it goes in. And sometimes when you push it in, the, the transformation thing, because the arm and the legs are connected, it sometimes pop off from, from each other. So yeah, just be careful on that. And now it doesn't want to stay. Did early. There we go. Okay, so here's another leg. So that's two legs done. Get the body ready. So pretty much transform it back into robot mode. Except leave the feet or his hands up here like this. Pull down the chest area and then we're gonna flip over his head and then push the chest back up. Turn it around and here's Abominus's, Abominus's uh, chest area. So yeah, go ahead and put him in, and they, there's uh, Crips on here, Crips on to his foot, uh, Ripper Snapper, go open it just a little bit so you can fit the dragon head in there, and it doesn't feel solid, but it's in there, so yeah, and just close it as much as it can, I don't know why I can't figure out how to close all the way, or maybe you don't put the dragon head in, maybe, so, nope. Okay, doesn't work like that. I was trying to see if it works like that because obviously we put it in like right here. It takes up room on the chest area. It can't close up all the way, so I guess we're stuck with that. Now we're going to do bright. Uh, pretty much the same thing. Put it in there. And uh, head is in the way. Actually, I'm going to leave his head out be easier transform be easier to put the dragon in like so there we go it's crypt uh it doesn't look really that crypt in it's, it's kind of 
weird. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, it's supposed to go in right here. And then push the push Bright's head back in to hold the uh, dragon head in. So yeah, we got something like this going on. He's standing up weird. Don't know why. Ah, okay. oh, no, that didn't work. Crap. I'm having problems with this one, guys. <clears throat> it's just a weird looking clip system for bright side. So it's supposed to go in like this and something like that. I guess that's all, all I can do with it for now. And I hope he stands up. I don't like how Whippers not his hands are. His legs are actually. They stick out too much. I'm going to change that. They could have done just a tad bit better on the legging stuff. Okay, we're just going to leave them like this for now. Okay, so we got that. And here's Rin Razor, the easiest one to do. Just flip his tail and boom, done. I just leave his arms on like this. I don't know, I don't remember what the instructions were, but his arms are going to stay up like this. That is my way. That is the way of the dude. Anyway, so there's there's a uh, holes up here. So and those peg those two pegs on each foot. So just peg them in. Boom. And I like to keep the toes up. So those like you know spike shoulders. So it's got like this going. I don't know what's with bright. I can't keep him standing still for some reason. Let me get me a higher camera stand. And we'll get the last one. Uh, so, uh, twin strike. Pull his tail down. Uh, my preference, I like to turn the feet around so it's spiking outwards. And just attach it right here. And like I said, lift the um, foot up. And there you go, you have a bomb in this if Bright stays the freaking uh, together with his leg. God, what is wrong with Bright? I had this down earlier. If it was solder, it didn't wiggle that much. Okay, hold on a second. I gotta fix Bright real quick. Okay, let's put you back in here. Da -da 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 -da. I guess this is leave you all the way open. Under a guy, you can do it. Okay, boom, right there. Close that up. Oh, come on, don't neck. Oh, boy, 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 right. Okay. Oh, actually, I'm gonna leave those, his fists out. There we go. So, be like a title fit. There we go. So, my recommendation, leave Bright's fist out and he will be A-OK. -okay. So we have Abominus here. <clears throat> Pretty cool looking figure and I'm <clears throat> going to make the camera stand just a tad bit higher. And he just fell right now. So yeah, pretty cool guy. Um, he doesn't have the sturdiest uh, feet ever because it's, <clears throat> it's kind of weird how it works because his is leg and his act uh, hunger's actual leg like bends so it's kind of a weird position awkward uh, to put him in but that's how it is I wish there was a posability in their um, leg in the Cyndasaurus or Whippersnapper and uh, broad snake form so you can get mobile flat surface to stand on because this guy is having a hard time standing up right now for some reason. He's very front heavy. I don't think I know why. I never put these arms back just a bit. Okay, there we go. So I had both arms forward a bit too much. So yeah, here's his, uh, here's Abominus, his head sculpt. So pretty cool menacing, very uh, Transformer Prime-esque. And articulation, it's whatever Hunger had, that's his articulation. Boom, he can kick you in the face and all that. Um, 
So yeah, uh, we're not done yet. Um, you take all the weapons to make into this hammer weapon, I guess. So take the saw gun, both hammers, and what's his name? Twin Strike. Don't know why he was the only one that came with the gray one, where everything else is like uh, still gray. So I think I'll switch out with Soundwave. No, I, I, Soundwave have the same hammer. Damn. Um, who was it? I think um, Smokescreen has a hammer that came with him. I might switch him out with that one. So yeah, but for now we're doing this. If I can get this pegged in, there we go. So he has his nice big old hammer weapon, and I like to put in Wind Razor's mouth because that's the only thing that looks like a hand right now. He's a uh, and his wings can be used as a shield, to my knowledge. So that's pretty cool. And Twin Strike is like a giant claw. Giant yellow claw doom. So yeah, that's my review on um, Abominus. I hope you guys enjoyed this review of Abominus. Stay tuned for more awesome reviews from Ghost Dude. And I'll see you guys next time. I think that's a good pose. He has his hammer on the ground. He got his claw open. He looks like he's ready to kill some um, Autobots and Decepticons. So yeah, uh, I'm zooming in too much. So yeah, that's my review. And I'll see you guys next time.